Hi folks, welcome to the exercise of the month for Kona Fitness. Today we're looking at the Turkish get up, a um, pretty popular functional motion that's commonly done with uh, a kettlebell, but you can do it with dumbbells and even barbells. Um, today we're going to show you how to do it correctly, a couple of different variations, um, and some tips to watch out for. So let's have a look at the Turkish get up. Okay, what we're doing here is a right arm kettlebell get up. You can do it with a dumbbell, you can do it with a barbell. We're going to start with the kettlebell. Doing it on our right hand, if you're going to do it on your left, everything is obviously just reversed. But for right hand, you notice the right arm is straight up in the air, as vertical as you can possibly have it, both shoulders on the ground laying on your back. The right leg is bent, so same as the arm that's uh, lifting the weight. The left leg is dead straight, and the left arm is straight out at 90 degrees. That'll play a, a big role in stabilizing the movement uh, later on. The first segment of the motion is simply an abdominal crunch where you push the weight up to the sky and pu push, roll your weight into your left hand so that you basically come into what we call the sitting position. From here we throw the left leg back and you then become into a lunge position and simply lunge to straight up vertical. The downward phase is the exact reverse, kneeling and then laying back down to the ground, keeping the, the weight vertical the whole time into the lunge position and lunging to the sky. Again, controlling down, keeping the arm vertical, throwing the left leg through and down onto the shoulders. A variation here is simply the change in the feet. What you'll see is still the same start, still the same sitting position. We switch the legs here. You simply switch before lifting the bum off the ground and then into our lunge position, lunging to the sky. Again, the same in reverse as usual, lunging down, then into the sitting position and controlling down into the laying position. Um, again, same roll into the left hand, arm goes straight up to the sitting position. From the sitting position, switch the feet right there into our lunge position and lunge into the stance. These motions are all based on a simple standing lunge. So f this variation here is a squat. There's no lunge at all. You notice it's a squatting motion and again on the way down is a squat. And there's no right or wrong, slightly less popular but just as good. So there you have it folks, breaking it into its segments, the sitting position, the lunging position into the stance and in reverse from stance to lunge to sitting and laying on the shoulders. From shoulders there's the sit position, the lunge position and standing. Try to look at the weight the whole time, keep yourself stable, keep the weight vertical the entire time and that there is the Turkish get-ups folks, all the best.